Hi, I'm Corey Weatherton uh, from Integra Coach. I'm the Director of Product Development here, and I'm excited to show you today the new 2023 Vision XL 34G floor plan. So again, the 34G floor plan, I know when we're inside the coach, a lot of you are gonna be wondering, what is this floor plan? It's a great floor plan. I wanna rush out to my dealer and buy it. I just wish I knew what that floor plan was. The 34G Vision XL by Integra Coach. I wanna highlight some of the new 2023 features today but also just give you a general walk around of this unit. You know, here at Integra Coach, our goal is to be the quietest riding, best handling motorhome at each price point. And we accomplish that in a couple ways. Uh, first of all, it all starts with the chassis. At Integra Coach here, uh, we design our chassis around ride and handling. So this is a Ford F53 chassis. All of our Vision XL floor plans will either be on a 22,000 pound chassis or a 24,000 pound chassis. Um, our Visions, those will all be on 18,000 pound chassis. But as we bump up to the Vision XL, 22 and 24,000 pound chassis. So what does that matter? Um, it matters because it, it really improves the ride and handling. Um, a lot of us are familiar with an F-150 uh, or an F-350. If you and I were to get into an F-150 um, down at a dealership's lot, we'd take it for a drive and it handles a lot like an SUV. The suspension's soft, it gives me a nice ride. And then we go get in an F-350 and take that for a test drive. Kind of feels like you're riding on a brick. I mean, it, the suspension is hard, it's rough, you're feeling everything. Uh, but then the key difference is we know we're gonna be hauling with this truck. So we put 750 pounds in the beds of both trucks. We get in that 150 and it feels a little bit squirrely in the rear end. We get in that 350 and all of a sudden that suspension has softened up some and rides like that 150 used to. Well, so when I say 22, 24,000 pound chassis, for a lot of folks, it just doesn't make much sense. So I like to use that 150, 350 analogy. Uh, we're building up a chassis size when in reality we don't have to. Uh, we'd have good cargo carrying capacity if we build on a smaller chassis, uh, but we really want to eliminate a lot of that squirreliness of the motorhome, um, the suspension just being overstressed. Uh, so we start with a 22 and a 24,000 pound chassis here on the Vision XL. Now, something that's unique to Integra Coach is we put a ride and handling package on everything we build. Like I said, our goal is to be the quietest riding, best handling coach at each price point. So on this Integra Coach Vision XL, we put an Easy Drive Elite package on this coach. And some of the new things that, I, that we've done for this model year is to just enhance the drivability of this coach. Quietest riding, best handling, we've got to continue to stay ahead and, uh, and accomplish those things. So the first thing that we've done on this coach for this model year, super excited about it, is we've added a Bilstein steering stabilizer. If you Google it, um, it's a Bilstein, it goes by Bilstein steering stabilizer or even Bilstein steering dampener. Um, I've noticed in a lot of owners forums, um, I'm on the internet frequently, my role, I like to see what everybody's doing, um, kind of the, the end customer's user experience. And I noticed that a lot of folks on this coach, um, really on any F53 chassis, they're adding steering stabilizers. Why do they do that? Simply because this F53 chassis is kind of notorious for some steering wheel play. Um, it, even though you're going straight, there's still those micro adjustments. So this Bilstein steering stabilizer actually reduces that significantly. And so the end result is that you as the customer, you as the proud owner of this coach, you experience a lot less driver's fatigue with this Bilstein steering dampener. So we're super excited about that. Second enhancement we've done on our Easy Drive Elite package on this Vision XL for this model year is we started to install Coney shocks. Uh, Coney shocks are a great shock. We've got a partnership with them. We install them on a lot of our products. And, uh, and these shocks are special shocks. They're Coney FSD shocks. So uh, frequency selective dampening. So frequency selective dampening. This shock, even though there's not any microchips in it, there's no brains in it, it's a smart shock. It knows that as you start to do a clover leaf getting off of the interstate, that you're starting to experience a little body roll. And the shock on that body roll side, it just provides the stiffness there. It doesn't allow a lot of hydraulic fluid to go through, and it gives you more stability when you're cornering. The shock is also smart in that it knows that uh, I just slammed and hit a big pothole. And there again, uh, that shock opens up more and allows a lot more hydraulic fluid to go through it uh, to absorb that impact. So it's a comfort shock 
and it's a stability shock. Uh, super excited about those Kony shocks with the frequency selective dampening. Um, we do add other components to our Easy Drive Elite system. I would encourage you to uh, look on our, on our website you'll be able to find those components, but I just wanted to quickly highlight those two things that are new for model year 23, because I wholeheartedly believe that it will enhance your driving experience. Go hop into a competitor's uh, unit, take it for a drive, and then come over to ours, and I can guarantee you that you're gonna experience a big difference in the ride and handling uh, because of our whole Easy Drive Elite package, but especially those two components that we've added. Um, so that is the, the Vision XL that has that. Um, also on this coach, we have a 120 inch diagonal windshield. It is the largest in the industry. Uh, our goal here at Integra Coach is to give you a great experience. And part of that great experience is safety. Uh, 120 inch diagonal windshield. So um, our windshield, if you look at our competitors, it goes lower than what our uh, competition does. As well as on the side of the coach, as that windshield wraps around, it uh, moves the A-pillar back and so your visibility is incredible. So not only as you're heading towards the Rocky Mountains and you see the mountains in front of you, you have that HD experience, but also we give you safety. Why? Because at the campgrounds, uh, kids constantly going across the road, you have to be able to see. At the gas stations, there's obstacles, barriers, you have to be able to see. 120 inch diagonal windshield, largest in the industry, and it's primarily for your safety. Now this Integra Coach Vision XL, we do have side cameras and a rear backup camera. Now at this price point, that's going to be standard uh, on this coach as well as with our competition. Uh, but just wanted to point that out because there again, just one more step for safety. A big 2 plus 3 on our window. Um, we are really leading the industry in our warranty. We have a 2 year limited warranty um, plus a 3 year structural. Why do we give you a 2 year warranty? Well, we do it for a couple reasons. First and foremost, we know uh, that we have confidence in our product and so we're going to give you the peace of mind to give you a two-year warranty. Quite honestly, if we didn't have confidence, we'd only give you a one-year warranty or maybe a six-month warranty, but we've got confidence. So it is a full two-year warranty. Um, that way it protects you for two camping seasons. Uh, the three-year is a structural warranty and that's just simply um, uh, your walls, your roof, your floor, uh, really protects against delamination. Um, so a two plus three warranty, uh, very proud of that because we're leading the industry in that, as I said. Um, as we come back to coach, you're gonna see over the door, uh, we do have an awning to cover that simply because uh, it protects you from the elements. We don't have to do that. Really, we could get away without doing that. Uh, most people wouldn't notice that we don't have that. But at the same time, we do it simply because um, it, is, it is a luxury coach. It's, a, it's an Integra Coach Vision XL, and so we want to give that to you. Um, you're going to notice a whole new graphics package for this model year. Um, we went ahead and changed for model year 23. Absolutely beautiful. We're uh, passionate about that. We want the outside of the coach uh, to really pop as you're going down the road. So standard is this graphics package, uh, but also we do offer uh, four new paint options for this model year. And I think they're absolutely beautiful. Um, on our website, you'll be able to scroll down and see pictures of those, uh, but they are different than last year and absolutely beautiful. Uh, exterior entertainment. We do have an exterior entertainment center here. You are seeing uh, an insignia TV in here. Uh, you do have AM, FM, Bluetooth, uh, radio, as well as a DVD player in that, as well as your exterior speakers. Uh, we put them down at head level simply because uh, we know that as you're camping, you don't want to blast the sound overhead um, out to your neighbor's campsite. Uh, so we put them down at uh, head height. As we come back to coach, you're going to see a great, incredible pass through storage. Um, this is something that we are passionate about. What is the number one complaint on any motorhome? I wish there was more storage. So here at Integra Coach, uh, we are doing pass-throughs. So it actually goes um, through the belly of the coach. A lot of times when folks are out camping or getting ready to go camping, they do want to take uh, the long table with them. They want to take a long fishing pole, uh, maybe even kayak paddles, things like that. The question is, is where do I put these things? Well, at Integra Coach, we give you a pass-through storage in every one of our Gas Class A products, and most of our products have at least two pass-throughs. And so I uh, wanted to show you that simply because um, it's something that we know you're going to have questions about. Coming back further, um, you will see that we are using frameless windows. Uh, at this price point, we sure better be. Um, frameless windows are incredible. They tilt out about three inches. Great things about these windows, there's two things that I love about them. First of all, if I'm out camping or, um, and I, I open up my windows, 
And I start to canoe, start to kayak, um, go play in frisbee with the kids, uh, and I see some, some dark rain clouds and it starts to sprinkle. Um, unless you're in a monsoon, you just get a sprinkle. These windows, the way they open up, uh, you're not going to get water inside of your coach. Now obviously, uh, you need to think ahead, you need to look at your weather app, um, but that is helpful with these. Second thing that's great about these is that uh, your, your rubber protective, your rubber seals are protected on this. Um, the sliding windows, uh, your seals are exposed to the harmful UV rays and with time those seals will break down. Um, these are protected by the glass and so um, we don't have any, any problems or any anticipation that these will break down during the lifetime of your coach um, because your seals are protected. Coming around, um, we do see we have a ladder on the rear of this coach. All of our roofs are fully walkable. Um, it is one solid sheet of fiberglass and fully walkable. That way during maintenance, you're able to check your seals uh, and inspect the roof in the process. Um, on the roof, what will you find? You'll find a 195 watt solar panel. That 195 watt solar panel does have a dual controller. So it is monitoring your house battery and your chassis battery simultaneously. If by chance your, your chassis battery is topped off, it will then just divert power only to your house battery. So 195 watt solar panel comes standard on this coach. And then also something else that's up there is a WineGuard 2.0 Connect. It's a Wi-Fi range extender as well as a 4G hotspot. Um, that's going to be standard. So layman's terms, how do you use that? What is it? The Wi-Fi range extender to you is free to use. So if I'm parked um, a distance away from a Wi-Fi uh, signal, maybe at the campgrounds, maybe at a, a restaurant that offers free Wi-Fi, it'll grab that signal and it'll actually amplify it into the coach. And so your hotspot is definitely stronger. So you don't have to uh, use the data from your phone. Um, you can use Wi-Fi that you're around. It's, it's a great feature. Um, we're, we're passionate about that because we know in this day and age that we're in, a lot of folks are actually working remotely um, or even streaming. All of the TVs on, on this coach are smart TVs. And so uh, if I want to stream an app, I better have Wi-Fi or I better have a strong um, cell signal. And so the second thing is if I'm away from Wi-Fi, um, this WineGuard 2.0 Connect, I can actually get a data plan through either WineGuard or one of your cell providers uh, that will be a mobile hotspot going down the road. So uh, somebody can be driving, somebody can be sitting back at the dinette or even in the passenger seat uh, working on their computer and, and getting work done while they travel. This coach as well has a, a 10 gallon gas electric hot water heater. Um, 10 gallon gas electric, that's a lot of hot water. It runs off of electricity or liquid propane. So where am I getting my electricity? I'm getting it from my shore power or my generator. Uh, this does have an onboard LP tank. Um, I can use them independently or I can use gas and electric at the same time. Great thing about that is that um, it is a rapid recovery system. So though it's a 10 gallon tank, um, it will replenish itself quite quickly and, uh, and you'll be able to get enough water for your shower and doing dishes. Um, plenty of hot water in this coach. This is a 50 amp coach has a 5,500 watt uh, Onan generator, and it is, um, it is the micro quiet one, the whisper quiet one. Uh, so decibels on this, you're at about 70 decibels. Um, did a little bit of research as I'm talking right now, I'm about 68 decibels. Uh, so it is a hair louder than what I'm currently speaking. So it's a, it's a great product. Um, it's really uh, the, the generator that's used most frequently in the industry. And this coach, 50 amp coach, has enough power for everything you need. Uh, so that was the exterior of the coach. Let's go inside the 34G Vision XL. I want to show you some things in there. Alrighty, so we're inside the 34G Vision XL. And it is, I guess, first thing I noticed is it's absolutely beautiful. Um, we've changed some of our fabrics for this year. Has a great feel to it. Um, as I'm touching this, you know, right away I think of we've had this last model year, but what's great is that uh, we've got power theater seats in this. Simply push one button and, and they extend, uh, push the other one, they go back. There's also a USB uh, charging area in that. Absolutely, ex you know, just pleased with this. Um, I know you can't feel it through this video, um, but it has a great feel to it. It's a very durable material. And uh, our design folks did a great job for this model year. Um, right behind me, uh, something that is uh, something we regularly talk about. We take pride in it, this front overhead bunk. This front overhead bunk is a Euroloft system. Um, very quiet as it goes down, very quiet as it goes up, and very simple. There's no hinges on this. Um, you know, some of our competition will give you a manual one you have to pull down, or maybe if it is power, it's hinged and kind of clunky, and you, know, you get a loud pop in the process. Um, this is just straight down and straight back up. 
Um, the seats do have to be reclined a little bit because height wise, we're coming down to about right at this height as far as the top of the bunk. Um, there is a front and rear bumper on this, um, on the bunk itself, so a child can't roll off in either direction. As I stated outside, uh, this front overhead bunk's rated at 750 pounds, and so two adults can comfortably sleep up there uh, without having to worry about constantly rubbing arms with one another or getting too hot or anything of that nature. Um, so it is a great bunk system. Now this is an option, it's not standard, um, but I can tell you that most of our dealers will order in their units with this overhead bunk. Uh, for last model year, I know I said we're talking about this model year, but for last model year, we actually redesigned our dash. Uh, we gave some accent lighting on it, uh, some LED lights that way um, at night as you're in the coach, that could function as a night light or even just have it for, for ambiance um, as you're sitting back here uh, reclining and relaxing in the main area. As you can see, both of the front seats will swivel. I turned that one around for demo purposes. Um, swivel around, we do give you a, a small table. Um, I would call it a cocktail table, maybe an hors d'oeuvre table that goes there, or even if your uh, dinner plate isn't massive, you could have two dinner plates there and in, enjoy uh, eating dinner while sitting in these front seats. Um, on the passenger side, there is a tray that does slide out uh, that going down the road somebody could do some computer work on. Um, that way it's comfortable for the uh, passenger. They don't have to have their computer sitting on their lap. They can have it uh, on that tray. There's also a 110 outlet up there. Uh, you do see a Sony infotainment unit. Uh, that is Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and also Bluetooth. Great thing about that is I know a lot of you will use uh, different apps as far as how you're going to get from point A to B. Some of you use Apple Maps, some Google Maps, some Waze. I know there's a lot out there, even, even your RV app. That way you're able to um, just stream onto there and uh, be able to see on a big screen going down the road where exactly you're going. Um, your front shade is a power shade. Your side shades are manual shades, and they are they will block out the light for you, uh, both day and night. Uh, it'll block the light for you. And so if you want it completely dark in here, um, just go ahead and pull those down. It also keeps heat out. Great feature about those. Coming over here, um, our overhead cabinets, you're going to see beautiful overhead cabinets. We did change the wood color for this year. Um, it is different than 22. And so uh, very beautiful, we think. You're going to notice two metal struts. I point that out in every video. Why do I point it out? Uh, because quite honestly, these metal struts don't cost a lot of money. They're quality struts, but let's face it, they're still metal struts. A lot of our competition is only going to give you one in an overhead cabinet door this size. And uh, as a result, like I said, quietest riding, best handling coach. Going down the road, we don't want this thing to, to, to just be rattling the whole time. And so we give you two metal struts. Now this is going to be loud. Brace yourself. It slams shut. Um, I wouldn't encourage you to do that all the time just simply because it'd get annoying. Um, but I like to do that simply because that, that shows that as I'm going down the road, I'm not going to get a lot of rattle. Um, there's a lot of retention within those struts. Also, if I take a corner maybe too sharp, I'm not going to have everything come flying out. So something simple, something low cost, but not everybody does it. Um, so love pointing that out. Um, it's just one small thing that anybody could do. In this coach, you are gonna see we have our, our night shades there, but then also we have a day shade. Day shades are great, and these are in our main living area because they block out a lot of the sun's UV rays, but then also a lot of heat as well. You know, as your ACs are going in this, this does have a 15K with a heat pump and then also a 13.5 uh, AC. So it is enough to keep this coach cool, but obviously, um, power consumption, we're always worried about. We're always concerned about that. So um, in our Vision XLs, we do give you day shades in the living area as well. As we come over to uh, this other side of the coach, you are going to see that uh, the television is on a TV lift. It is on a televator. You can watch going down the road if you'd like, or if you want the, the light from outside, or just a TV out of sight. Um, you're able to put it down. I say a TV out of sight because I know when you're camping, um, TVs can be distracting. And so let's just put them down, let's enjoy nature around us and enjoy the camping experience and truly live in the moment. Uh, the dinette, the dinette, this is exclusive to Jayco. A lot of our um, competitors, or really every competitor, you're going to see a dinette mechanism that there's a lever and I flip the lever over, push the table down, and then lock it back into place. The problem with that uh, dinette system is, and I'll tell you, we've used it uh, in the past. 
I would be working maybe an RV show or I would be using one of them on my own camping trips. It would be locked in place. I'd put my elbows on the table and it'd drop down about an inch. And so this mechanism we use, it is uh, exclusive to Jayco. It's a great system. It's very stable. Um, I simply lift up on the outer edge and then push it down. As it's all the way down, the tension on that spring is released and then I slide my my mattress is over and then uh, I'm able to sleep there and then to put it back up into place lift it up um, and then it just simply locks into place like that very easy nothing to go wrong with it and then I think also what's key is it's just very stable coming around you are going to see um, in this 34g that we do offer a fireplace that is standard it's not an option great thing about this fireplace is I can have it on just simply for ambiance, meaning it's not producing heat, or it does have a heating element inside of it, so that way um, it can be a supplemental heat source for, for this coach. Uh, so we have that as a supplemental heat source, then I also said one of our air conditioners is a 15K with a heat pump. Great thing about that is I don't have to fire up my furnace on this coach. Um, I wanna conserve my propane, and so this heat pump is electric. It'll run off of either your generator or your shore power. Uh, both your fireplace and your heat pump are very effective on cool fall mornings or, or maybe a, a colder spring night to be able to just uh, add the heat into this and really preserve you from having to fire up your furnace. Um, solid surface countertop you're going to notice. Um, absolutely beautiful. We do have sink covers that go in here as well, but I did take those off simply so that you can see um, we do have a farmhouse sink, single basin. Great thing about this is if I do have a larger pot, a lot of times your, your RVs will have a double basin, uh, but it's not big enough to actually put the pot in. And so we give you uh, this larger basin for that. Um, it is a great thing. Coming back here, we do have a residential size microwave. Um, that's not going to be something that you see in a lot of motorhomes, but in this Vision XL, you will see it. What does that matter? Because it matters because really in those small microwaves, who makes a casserole that size or who warms something up that's that size? A, a residential size microwave, perfect for that. You are gonna see the Furion cooktop and also stove. Um, neat thing about this is there again, you have accent lighting that can function as a nightlight. So I always turn those on during videos because I know a lot of people like Christmas tree lights. These look like Christmas tree lights and it obviously helps sell motorhomes. Just kidding. We've got more features than just this to sell a motorhome. Um, that's why I love Integra Coach is because we're giving you a product that doesn't rely on the visual appeal. Yes, it does have that, but we give you substance as well. And so um, it still is nice to turn those on, right? Uh, so coming back, we do have a residential size uh, refrigerator. Um, it is uh, dual sided. So we've got our uh, refrigerator side, we've got our freezer side. In this specific unit, we do see ice and water in the door. I say in this specific unit, we do see ice and water in the door because um, we are still experiencing supply chain issues. And uh, one of the things, it might be hard to believe, maybe not, one of the things that is difficult for us to get a steady supply of is a refrigerator. And so this is a GE refrigerator in here. I know we have used an LG refrigerator. Um, if we sub, I guarantee you, we will not sub with an off-brand refrigerator. Uh, we give you quality name brands in Integra Coach units, um, but this one does have a GE with your ice and water in the door, um, but it is residential, massive. Uh, this one is a 21 cubic foot refrigerator. Come back and check out the bathroom. Now, one of the things I love about Integra Coach bathrooms is just simply they are spacious. You're gonna see a shower in this coach that uh, you can easily bend over and wash your feet and not worry about touching the side of that shower. Uh, massive shower, massive bathroom. We give you a skylight in there, uh, a lot of natural light. It does help with uh, putting on makeup. If you're putting on makeup, it helps with uh, being able to see and brush your teeth without utilizing power. Um, very large bathroom, beautiful new cabinetry as I mentioned, and then also stainless steel undermounted sink and also a stainless steel um, uh, faucet. So inside of our 34G, uh, we do option a combo washer dryer. Um, some customers prefer that, some don't. We also give you the clothes rod just in case you don't prefer that. If you're at a dealership that does have a 34G with no washer dryer in it, um, and you do want one, just relax because we do pre-plumb these. So it's as simple as the dealer getting a combo washer dryer, sticking it in there, hooking up the plumbing connections and plugging it in. Um, this motorhome, the 
Vision XL. It is powered by the Firefly system. Great thing about this, power, this Firefly system is it is a whole house control. I have my electricity, I have my lighting, I have my temperature, I have my slides and awnings. Um, I can also monitor my tanks. I can run my, or set my parameters for my auto gen start, when I want it to kick on, when I want it to kick off. Great thing about this is you can have um, an app on your phone. So you can be outside at your campsite, sitting around the campfire, and you're noticing it's starting to cool down a little bit. From your phone, without coming inside and leaving all the action outside, you can turn on your heat pump in your air conditioner if you choose to, or Junior's gonna be coming in and it's a dark coach and Junior's afraid of the dark. From your app, you can just simply turn on the specific lights that you want to be on uh, so that uh, somebody can see inside this coach. So Firefly system, we use it. We've been using this for years. We started in our big diesel pushers with it. It was a great product and so we've moved it to other product lines as well. Um, whole house um, control system here. Also, you can use your phone to control it. 34G bedroom, um, you're gonna see this is not a queen size bed. Uh, this is gonna be an RV king size bed. Great thing about this is I know in a lot of your homes today that uh, you do have the larger beds and so as much as we can, where we can, uh, we'll give you an RV king. Now for some of you who say, I don't need that much room, can I get a queen size? Unfortunately, we cannot option a queen size. So our floor plans kind of dictate the size of the bed and from there, um, as, uh, as one of my teachers said when I was a kid, you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. And I'm just joking on that one. Um, but we do know that some prefer others, so we have other floor plans that do have a queen size bed. This 34G, it is a king. New for 23 on both nightstands, you're gonna see a wireless charging port. Uh, that wireless charging port, uh, just simply lay your smartphone on top of that. If you have an old school flip phone, or maybe you don't have a wireless charger uh, on your phone, uh, you, it does have a USB port. Just simply, it's uh, a toggle, you push it down, it pops up, USB ports there. Um, also for model year 23, inside of all of our overhead cabinets, we do have a 110 outlet, and then also cut into the center of the overhead cabinet down below, there's a rubber grommet. Uh, so that way you can have power up above you, and then you can run a cable or a cord or anything down through that grommet. Um, just simply because we know there's some, some uh, devices that maybe you don't want seen, we put the 110 outlet up there for that. Notice the, the spacious wardrobe back here as well. So in that washer dryer area, as I said, we, we give you a, a closet rod up there, but then we give you two uh, wardrobes back here, as well as a bank of drawers down below. Um, something about our, our motorhomes is, like I said, on the outside of the coach. Storage is a huge thing, and so we want to give you as much storage as possible. Maybe what you see isn't enough. Well, we give you storage behind the television as well. Um, some folks I know will put mount safes back in there. Uh, some people will maybe put valuables back in there um, because that's a spot that most individuals don't think to look. Um, so we give you that storage back there. Um, just an abundant amount of storage inside of this coach. Your overhead cabinets as well over your bed, a lot of storage. Nightstands, I have storage on each side. So we give you a ton of storage. So this has been a look at the 2023 Integra Coach Vision XL 34G. Again, my name is Corey Weatherton, the Director of Product Development here at Integra Coach. If you have any questions, I'd encourage you to contact your local dealer. Um, start to develop a relationship with them. Maybe you love this floor plan and, and you want to know if they have one in stock. Best thing to do is to contact your local dealer. Or if you'd like to, maybe feel a little bit more comfortable with it, contact Integra Coach. Let them know what state you're from and also what you're interested in, and they will direct you to the in-house sales rep that's responsible for the state that you're in. We'd love to answer any questions that you have. Um, thank you for your time today. It was a pleasure to be able to show you this great unit, and uh, hopefully you've been enticed and you're ready to go out and buy one. Thanks a lot.